hope I'm ready. This is gonna be one of the hardest JRPG battles of all time. This is it. Just make it through here and it's finally over. Where are you going, Divine Offering? <clears throat> the Queen. The Cadaver Queen. So that heretic deceived you. What a pitiful princess. To proceed ahead is taboo. Before you accumulate for her sins, I shall offer you to the Deathless. Present her your flesh. Cadaver style. Uh. Maelstrom. Lacrimosa and Guard. Ugh. Beast Queen. Dever style. Oh, damn. Lacrimosa. Guard. Beauty Queen. Wanderlust. Damn it, that. She fights just like that damn succubus from before. But I can stack on you too, you know? <sighs> and I have Wanderlust. Uh, yeah, three people with Wanderlust. Let's see how you like that. Haha! Cadaver style again? I've seen these bastards before. Sky Queen. Oh, there goes that guy. Uh. Oh yeah! Oh no! Okay, I guess I need to keep an eye on the Dragon Program buff, or I'm screwed. Oh yeah. Let's see, I like this. Ooh. Uh.
That's another one down. Oh, come on, there's still more. Ugh. Damn. Holy shit. Oh no. Stunned her, but she stunned some of us too, so this is bad. Summon another marionette. I've stacked so much crap on her right now. But she buffed her attack, so this is bad actually. Seriously, how many more forms do you have? I'm starting to get mad here. Immortal Queen. This is the final phase, and I'm not sure I have a chance. Oh no, she's stacking on us! Ugh. Ugh. There. Curse you. Uh. 
Let's see, what is the best choice here? Damn, it's just gonna take forever even if I keep stacking status effects. I'm really hoping one of these will just stall her turns, but... I'm not that lucky, am I? Fuck no, not Soul either. Please, why can't- why is she not getting stunned by the multiple statuses I piled up on her? That's not right. Wasted her spells that time. But her poison is still extremely annoying. Oh, Ceramic Veil can negate Soul Eater! That makes my life slightly easier. But it's still t I can't stack Weaken on her very well. I can't stack anything on her very well, to be honest. This kind of sucks. Grr. I need- I should have made more Immortal Potions. Poisons. The hell is Whale of the Dying? It buffed her and removed all status effects. Speed and defense up. Oh no. Multi hit, no. Oh, 
shit, she got she got a status effect on me. Use the whale to dying again to remove all her status effects. Curse you. Even move at all. Seriously, it's stacked way too high. <sighs> this is bad. I may have to restart the battle because this is looking impossible. Man, this is horrible. Do anything. I didn't even know they could stack that high. Good, I managed to get a meat shield. I did it, just barely. It was all luck. I just have to get one more attack off, and I can, despite the, despite the paralysis. Okay, neutral ending. Here I come. They crash because they didn't expect me to actually win. Oh shit! Never mind. All okay. It's all great now. Neutral ending is mine. <sighs> Genie, you okay? Yes. Yes, I am. Your voice. Brother. With the queen dead, the goddess will pick a new one. 
Better be it before anything happens, eh? What does happens to the neutral ending? What will you do, brother? Um, er... I'll follow after. Just give me a sec. Liar. You're just planning to leave me alone again. <clears throat> well, uh... Brother Marta. My precious brother who should be dead. After you came all this way to the world of the living, <coughs> I don't want to pass you by again. You heard about my death too? Well, then you gotta understand. <clears throat> right now, I'm not living and not dead either. With a dead man's body, I can't go through that door. To heaven. Huh? Heaven? Well, of course, beyond purgatory is heaven. What else could it, would it be? Then, son, you... Seems in some cases, if your sins are too heavy, you vanish without getting to go there. But a good kid like you should be okay. I did kill an innocent person- Oh, no! I just realized, this means Asmund got the- must have gotten the neutral ending, too. I did kill an innocent person or two along the way, you know. Well, good luck. Don't good luck me, I don't want to pass on. You go over there, you won't suffer anymore, see? You mean I'll lose the ability to feel suffering, don't you? I hope someone out there can post the kill at 15 humans ending, because I failed to get it. You're not opposed? Look, staying behind in this kingdom would just be a hell, f hell for you. Hell? No. Hell would be a world without you, brother. I'm scared to die. That's part of it. But if you aren't going to be there, then there truly isn't any reason for me to go. I'll... Yes, I'll live in this deathless world. After killing people, the dead, and the queen, I feel like I can do anything. I see. In that case, Genie, what should I do? I came b back just for you. Use me as you like. <clears throat> well, brother, can you shut your eyes? Could this be incest? Well, that ending doesn't seem too bad. Even if they're stuck in this kingdom, at least they're together. Plus, some of the undead around here are actually pretty friendly, so... Maybe they can try to dismantle the human enslavement system... ...and make the kingdom a better place. Maybe. Ugh, that was intense. Seriously, I don't think I could beat the game a second time. I I had to luck out on so many of the bosses. My performance was absolutely pathetic. Seriously, do you see the way I just barely beat the final boss? If I if I if both of them got their turns stalled one more time, she would have finished us off with powerful single targets. Seriously, I just lucked out there. I thought I could keep things under control by blasting her with status effects, but she has that one skill that keeps allowing her to recover from everything. It buffs her and recovers all her statuses. It's, it's just insane. It's like they knew the player would try to spam a skill like... Like, what's it called? The... Um, Wanderlast. Yeah, they knew I'd try to spam Wanderlast for an easy win, so they decided to work against me there. And that's all the paperwork. She ch tore through so many of my undead, too. Congratulations again to the newly thrown Eternal Genie the Seven. Were, 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 were there six more before her? Seems there's a message about the Ten Kingdom Conference coming soon, so keep an eye out for letters. Er, so I'm now I'm queen, right? What should I even do? Make whatever kingdom you want. Just preferably don't be like the old queen. Oof. What do I do? If you're really stuck, your brother's always here to help. I'm all set to take you to heaven. Are you planning to kill me again? 
It's my duty to protect my sister from unhappiness. Of course, right? We're, <coughs> we're queen follower before our sister and brother now. Make friends with my life, I'll draw the suitable order. Ooh, sounds scary. Order the order, I'll gladly obey, your majesty. Like I said, I came back just for you, so shoot. You'll do anything? Sure will. Well, brother. No, servant Marta. Um. Yes. Ahem. Yeah, yeah. By my authority as queen. Erm. Um, I ordered at you. Keep watch. As um as, as I sleep. Uh, you see. Keep me company at night, man. Er, yes. Is this the happy ending? It seemed pretty happy and lighthearted. Okay, in case anyone was wondering, here's my setup. Partially inspired by Asmund's strategy. Some divine spirit stones just for the sake of getting decent defense. Everyone's using long range weapons only. I have. Marta has angel indulgence for dealing with the uh, beast cuts for the queen's ads. Both of them have apocalypse in order to debuff the queen and hope she doesn't use that stupid recovery move. Okay, bikini armor just for s some extra hit points. Ball gag on Genie so she can sustain her uh, her SP consumption. He doesn't have anything like that, so his ally is instead. So the, his ads. Uh, Marta's ads will have to just throw beer at him. And of course, I have a. T and unlike me, bring more immortal potions. I was running pretty low back there. Maybe. And maybe spam a few more neutralizers than usual, because seriously, those paralyzed. Those numbing effects add up fast. Boom. Okay, let's see if this works. Sheenie, are you okay? Yes, I am. Your voice. Brother. The queen dead, the goddess will pick a new one. Better be before anything happens, eh? Troop as I... I actually I used the save edit online site, so hopefully this will cause some kind of change that I desire. No, brother, I can't go there. Now that the queen is gone. I need to stay here to achieve an important dream. I have a dream that one day I don't I don't know the lines. Dream to kill all the humans and build a true kingdom of the dead. Yup, looks like save edit online worked. The trick is to edit variable 7. 7, yeah. Edit to either negative 15 or positive 15. That is the trick. What? This land belongs to Deathless Morte. Those who live will only be unhappy. So I will kill them. I'll give them deaf and undeaf and make them all happy. Was that your plan for the start? Gee, you're wrong. Letting these death shunning monsters prevail? There's no way I... You're talking an awful lot like you're a living human, brother. Brother Marta. My precious brother who should be dead. That we can meet again must be a miracle of Morte, mustn't it? Seeing you with my own eyes made me realize something deep down. Love after death is eternal. The true happiness people seek is an immortality. Listen, brother. Don't take me beyond purgatory or anything like that. Walk this endless road of after death with me. The dead have a queen, but I have only you. Is this my punishment? For violating taboo? 
You are my only regret. I couldn't help but pity you, being played with by corpses. I came here to save you from this hell. I... I love you, brother. Please don't ever leave Genie. I still have no idea how to get the chainsaw, though. I heard someone managed to get the chainsaw super weapon that was only made for dev purposes. It's possible they removed it entirely when they, when they found out people were using it, but nothing's stopping me from changing those variables. <laughs> Look, brother. People are happily walking the streets as ever. Morte looks so weird in this one. Don't tell me he, she took, she mind controlled him or something. Aren't these endless days so wonderful? Eternal goddess Morte Moses. Please continue to protect this immoral kingdom and my beloved citizens. And that is the kill 15 plus humans ending. Yeah. Okay, hope I got the save human ending this time. I'll know for sure later. Genie, you okay? Yes. I am. Your voice. Brother. With the queen dead, the goddess will pick a new one. Bear be it before anything happens, eh? Say, brother, would you be opposed to me inheriting the throne? What are you saying? Well, you see, I feel I want to save the people left behind this kingdom. Oh yeah, I got it. I want to become queen and kill all the living dead who run rampant in this land. Seriously, if you t kill or save too many people, Genie just goes nuts. Does that have anything to do with your own happiness? No. I have always been and will always remain unhappy. After all, for sake of people I hardly know, I'll now have to bury my brother with my own hands. Bury me, huh? Huh. I see. Yeah, I guess so. <clears throat> if you're gonna live as a human, you gotta destroy all the, all the undead, huh? I put lots of effort into coming here, you know. Bad enough of you just brushed me off, but now you're making threats at me. Honestly. It's real unfair. Brother Marta. My precious brother who should be dead. Why did you come back? You, if anyone, should have known what I would do from the start. I acknowledge that. But even after my own death, I guess I couldn't understand the reason. Surely you don't want to be a toy to walking corpses, hurting people for somebody else's sake. Your hands are trembling for a reason. You'll be as sad about my death. So why would you do this? You're always taking such a self-tormenting road. Come on, Genie. If I'm gonna die, tell me. <clears throat> the more precious things I lose, and the more you grieve them, the more unbearable your worry becomes, doesn't it? So that's all I want. How tough is he anyways? Living Dead. That's his name. Wow. One shot. He didn't even put up a fight. I guess he can't bring himself to fight back even in self-defense. Of all the endings, I'd say this one is actually the darkest one. She doesn't even get to be with her brother this time. At least I'll have to play through the game again just to 
get all the endings. Even if I did have to use a save editor, it's not like I used a save editor to make the battles themselves easier. No, I, d I fought all those battles fair and square. For, well, sort of. I still had to grind for the, that divine stone, but still. Going to Morte Moses, eh, buddy? That's a great place. Used to be a corpse ridden hell three years back, though. But the new queen went through great labors to clean things up around there. Thanks to that, humans can get up to some pretty shady stuff, so I'm grateful. Shady stuff? Is that implying that humans would run amok without the qu queen to keep them in check or something? Heh <laughs> heh. If you're going there, give a good word to that lovely queen. Wait, huh? Hey, buddy? What was that all about? <clears throat> Is she killing off humans who defy her rule or something? Or maybe that buddy was that secretly an undead. What the hell happened to her skin? This may not be heaven or hell anymore. But just thinking about your worry makes me feel like I'm ascending. Brother. It's like she's partially zombified or something. In killing those zombies, she eventually became one. That was way too dark. Thank you for tuning in. If you enjoyed watching the Queen overcome my status spamming strategy, please leave a like and subscribe.